tragedy is that abantu be mashonale don't want to concede the fact ukuthi gukura wundi was a tribal motivated thing forget about destroying zapu i'm sorry laba ba kuzapu forget about that i can argue until cows come home that this issue was not just about destroying zapu if it was about destroying Zapu, why are the miseries of the Kukura Wundi still with us today? Why did it not end in 1987? In any case, the Kukura Wundi operatives said it to us, said it to, 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 to him, to him, to him, Ababe Kona. Sili Bulale Luguti, Lachon Chinkomo Zababam Kulbet. Ungabuzu, Nguplom, Nguplen Sungubani, they could not answer. <laughs> That's my background. So how do I then inherit this? It is not true. But this is a created ideological slant that is meant to empower them and disempower you to accuse you. And at this point, we need to explain what the word dissident was coined because for our friends' uh, 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 sake, the word dissident, you've been hearing it coming out from the various presenters. Including MTC including MDC. It is the word that was used in 1980-83 to describe those that were anti-ZANU or un-ZANU. And the word eventually, though in civilized societies, dissent is not a hateable thing. Dissent is an acceptable thing. But in our context, dissent meant that you were anti-society, you were anti-ZANU, PF, you were anti-Zimbabwe. So, it was not confined to the few who were hounded out of the united three armies, the Zipra, Zandla, and the, the Rhodesian army. The word dissent or dissident was then used to, in fact, refer to every person from Matebele land. Whether you were old, you were young, you were a baby, you were a dissident. Or unborn. Or unborn, you were a dissident. Or still in the planning process, you were a dissident. So a dissident will bear other dissidents. And that is why the killing rate was so high. The idea was that make sure that they don't produce much of other dissidents. If we, this investigation were to be done, and we come out with the true figure of the people of Matebeland who were slaughtered by Robert Muga, do you know that the population of Matebeland now could be 10 times, 15 times, 20 times what it is now? And those who do mathematics, they, they, they can talk, tell us about progression to say, if you start with a figure, by the time you give a time, a lifespan, a time span, the, the figure will travel, quadruple, and so forth and so forth.